Hi, I'm here with assistant head basketball coach Zach Cave. Team heads on to the playoff quest. Starts against Garden City at 4 p.m. Saints are just, uh, coach, how are they feeling? Things are good. You know, the, the, the spirits in practice today and um, was pretty good in terms of just our togetherness and how we're moving forward. Um, we had some guys on their feet, some guys off their feet, just more catered to what they need today prior to going into a big game tomorrow. Right. And, you know, you know, it's been, you know, an up and down season for the Saints, but playoff starts, you're zero and zero. So the, 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 um, the slate is clean for you guys. Um, one thing here is that the Axiomans, you've guys played them tw some twice this year. You've, um, you've come out on the short end both times. However, the old axiom is that it's tough to beat a team three times. So hopefully you guys are taking that to heart. Yeah, for sure. Beating a team three times at any level is tough to do. Um, we had a shootout with them at their place, um, first game back from break. Mm -hmm. um, we were high 80s and they were uh, high 90s. And then um, here a couple weeks ago when we played them, it was a close game with two minutes to play. Um, you know, they've got two really good guards on their team. Um, one of them, um, Brody Robinson, he makes them go. Uh, so, you know, so dependent on how he plays is how they play. Um, and you never know how that'll go. Like I said, playing a team three times, playing in a gauntlet of a conference that we do play in. Um, you know, tomorrow's going to be a good game, I expect, from both teams. Yeah, you, you know, you guys play each other twice already now. It's like we said the third again. Um, but at this point, you guys are so familiar with each other. No surprises really you expect for, for, from either ones, do you? No, you know, I mean, but with that being said, it is playoff basketball. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we scout them. I'm, I'm, I'm sure they'll scout us. And, you know, coaches always bring out a bag of tricks when the playoff time comes, you know, so – being prepared for whatever they may throw and them being prepared at whatever we may throw at them tomorrow. Um, I expect it to be a good game both ways, offensively and defensively. And, you know, hopefully we can go 1-0, and as you said. Right. One thing that I've noticed, the team over the last few games, you know, have, seems to be playing better, seems to have more chemistry. Agree? Disagree? Yeah, no, absolutely. Our guys have been playing more together. Um, I think what it is is guys accepting their role and, you know, excelling at their role, not trying to do things that they, you know, they're not supposed to do. We preach heavily on uh, playing to your strength, strength. So mm -hmm. whatever that is for a given or for a certain person, mm -hmm. um, you know, we have a, it's a recipe for good things to happen. And, you know, and we expect that to be tomorrow as well going in problem or solving problems as a team. And, you know, as new problems arise during the game, we're expected to solve those problems. And at the end of 40, um, coming out with the victory. So, what? okay, for you guys to win, what do you guys need to do? We need to control the pace, um, control the pace of the game, play fast when we need to play fast, slow it down when we need to slow it down. Um, and, again, play to our strength, strength. Everybody needs to do what they do best. Um, dominate their role, get it off the roll. Um, Luva needs to control the paint with, uh, with Nate and, 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 and Ron. Mm -hmm. um, and then our guard play, more so defending their guards. Um, and then again, controlling the tempo, being able to be heady um, and knowing when the right time is to control the pace. You know, if it's fast, if it's slow, whatever that looks like, um, those guards need to be focused in terms of just coming out and being ready to play high minutes and, and compete against another good backcourt. Yeah. Well, Coach, good luck tomorrow. Now, even though that the game is on the road, there will be a watch party here at Seward County in the greenhouse over there, so we'll be with you in spirit. Yeah. And you know that we're, you know, the people who can come up over there, not that long of a, dip, not that long of a ride. But, Coach, good luck tomorrow on Saturday, 4 o'clock at Garden City. Thank you. It's good to be green. All right.